Well, hi, and welcome to another Moments with Mike. Um, I've asked uh, our administrative assistant, Sarah, to join me today because we're, we're talking about a solemn occasion. Today's September the 11th when we're filming, and you may be watching it at a different time, but, uh, uh, but Sarah, you had to have been really, really young when that tragic day occurred. Uh, what's your memories of it? So I was three, so I was almost four years old, but the one memory I have is seeing my mom sitting on uh, their bed and just crying while the TV was playing. I don't remember what was on the TV or anything, but I just remember seeing a heavy emotion that day from everybody that yeah. I saw. Even a child could sense something's wrong, something uh, is is up, and, and our nation was uh, under attack, and uh, why do we, why do we mention this? Because 290 times in the Bible, the word remember occurs. And so God wants us to remember significant things. Even the Lord's Supper is all about remembering what Jesus did for us uh, on the cross uh, to die for our sins. Um, so uh, September 11th is a day to remember. A day to remember those who lost their lives and the families that were touched with grief. A day to remember the firefighters and the first responders who rushed not away from but into danger. A day to remember um, our law enforcement, our military that then and now are on the front lines to, to, to protect, to serve, to defend. Um, yeah, it's an important thing that we do remember. And today, as you Pause. I hope that you'll take time to remember those that we lost, but also the lessons that we learned. You know, I saw people come together at our church on September the 11th for prayer. People that I hadn't seen, but, but people that just knew that we needed to call on the Lord. And, and that's still the answer for us in our dark seasons today, to turn to Him and know that He's there, but to remember the things that we've experienced and hopefully to learn from them. So as you think of 9-11 and September the 11th uh, remembrance, would you just join with me in a moment as we just uh, have a brief prayer at the close. Father, thank you. Thank you for your faithfulness even during dark moments of our history. Thank you that you're there, Lord, faithful to hear us even when we've turn from you or when we've let you down, Lord, you're still faithful to be there in our hour of need. Help our nation, our leaders to turn to you because we need you today more than ever. Mm -hmm. And thank you, Lord, that we are called to remember and help us on this September the 11th to be grateful for those who sacrificed so that we might be safe and free in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Have a great day.